Hey guys, I'm back with another PvP tips video, and this week I'm going to be talking about how to do a death spiral. This is something people have asked me to cover, and it can be a really great way to help sink enemy crews, so hopefully this video will help you out. In Sea of Thieves, what is commonly referred to as a death spiral is when you stop an enemy ship and your boat is making a perfect circle around them, ensuring that you always have a shot and you continuously fire on them until hopefully they sink. This is one of the most effective techniques in Sea of Thieves, and it definitely helps if you have a crew to send someone over to kill the enemy team, but you can definitely do this solo. So the first step to starting a death spiral is to actually immobilize the enemy ship. You're going to be spinning around them, so you want them to stay in place. And so you can either anchor them, hit them with the rigging ball, but ultimately you want to knock down all of their mass with chain shot if you can. And if you have fire bombs, try and use those too, because you want to eat up as much of their resources as possible and keep them as busy as possible. The general idea is once you've stopped the enemy ship, you want to keep them at a 90 degree angle from your boat at all times. And to do this, you'll definitely have to raise your sails a little bit to give you some extra control. You do not want to be going full speed. And from there, it's really just about adjusting your wheel until you feel like you've got a good circle going. You should be firing on them at all times during this, but don't get me wrong, you're not going to get the wheel right on the first try. You will have to continuously go back and adjust until you fine tune that spin and get it just right. If you feel like you keep passing them up or you just can't get your circle right, chances are you might need to raise your sails a bit more and maybe even back your ship up to widen the circle. Again, you will not get this on the first try. You will have to continually adjust your wheel and your sails while still shooting them until you get it just right. You may not realize it, but in Sea of Thieves, the wind and the current will cause your boat to constantly drift. So even if you think you've found the perfect spiral and your wheel is aligned just right, you will still have to continually adjust it. As you can see, that circle you're making will be constantly moving as a whole. Now, if you notice them trying to lift their anchor, repair their mass, or if they start taking shots at you from their own cannons, blunder bombs are your best friend. Hitting them with the blunder bomb will interrupt whatever they're doing, and a proper mixture of blunder bombs and cursed cannonballs are essential in a death spiral because the most important thing is keeping them in place. Okay, that's it for me today. I give away codes every Wednesday, and occasionally I have Twitch drops over at twitch.tv slash blurbs, where I stream every weekday afternoon and most weekends. So if you have any other questions or you just want to come hang out or say hey, please feel free to stop by. As always, thank you for watching, and I hope you enjoyed the video.